Tonight, a Dixon County School administrator is accused of strip searching a female student alone in his office. The director of Dixon County Schools says they are investigating and they take these allegations seriously. News 4's Brittany Waters spoke with a student who says she was searched and her parents. Yeah, the student tells me that this all started with an investigation into her smoking a vape in school. She says when they were done searching her school bag, they asked her to search her clothes. Caitlin Wright says she was called to a Dixon County School Administrator's office after a video was found of her smoking a vape in school. Well, there was just a police at the door um, when he searched my book bag and then he left. Wright says the administrator closed the door and asked her to empty her pockets and hand over her jacket. He checked the pockets and uh, like shook it out and then he asked me to take my shirt off and I asked him if he was serious. and He said, yeah, that needed to strip search me. Wright says she obliged. I uh, took my shirt off. He shook it out. He asked me to take my shoes and my socks off. So I took them off. He shook my shoes out. And then he asked me to take my pants off. So I took them off and I handed them to him. Wright says after a few minutes, she asked if she could put her clothes back on. He um, lectured me, told me I had three days of ISS, and then he sent me to ISS. That's when I called my mom. I believe my daughter, she would never lie about something on this level ever. I mean, it not only risks his job, but that's her reputation as well. Wright's parents say they have spoken with a Dixon County captain about the case. And just before our interview, the family got a call from the school district. So is it still working? Not today, no ma'am. Is it still under investigation? Like I was told yesterday hey, that I would yes, hear something by this evening. Um, it's my understanding the district attorney's office is Investigation. Director of Dixon County Schools, Dr. Danny Weeks, sent news for this statement after we asked about the allegations against this administrator, saying, We take all such allegations seriously and are conducting a thorough investigation. The safety of our students and our employees is a priority for this system. Has this happened to another girl who hasn't been brave enough to say something? I hope it hasn't happened to anyone else because it makes me very uncomfortable at the school. And we did reach out to the DA's office multiple times throughout the day, but have not heard back. We have elected at this time not to identify this administrator. His attorney told me in a, in a quote that these allegations are categorically denied. I did reach out to the administrator directly for comment, but have not heard back. Tom and Tracy. Brittany Weiner tonight. Thank you.